Hey guys, oh, come on, come on, Fraps, there you go. Hey guys, what's going on? Bleaker here, and we are back with the next episode of Borderlands, the pre-sequel, and where we last left off, over there, we have just entered into the Eye of Helios. About damn time. Anything good? Alrighty, let's see here. Oh yeah, so now go. <laughs> so basically what happens is I think the game kinda glitched out. What happens is that'll drop and stuff and all manner of fun stuff. Uh but it's guns, kinda guns, complicated. Guns. Basically that the eye drains that thing that we need to drop. So guns, here's guns. what's gonna happen. Ooh, what's this? Max slam damage, crit damage. How much? Nah. Okay, this is how this is gonna work. This boss, I have so much trouble with. And you'll see why in a moment or two, I'm sure. But I literally have so much trouble with this boss. Like, it's not even fun. shouldn't be able to happen. Um. Okay. Oh, I know what happened. I accidentally entered into somebody else's game and they were further along than me. Okay, I got you. Um. This isn't good. Um, okay. So, um... Okay, so basically what happened is, I entered into another game on accident with a friend. As this character, I forgot to switch it over to my Wilhelm. And what happened was, they were actually further along in this mission than I was. So basically, Zarpadon... This is embarrassing. Zarpadon, which would be the boss I would face here, is dead. Already killed. She... So that's inconvenient. But on the bright side, this game is really glitched. I mean, uber glitched. I'll have to come back later and see what I can do about this. This isn't going to make for a good walkthrough. Basically, we're going to juice the eye with a lot of slack. That's the eye of the destroyer from the last game. The eye with a little bit of slack er, at a time. Game right? one, sure Borderlands that... one. Won't hurt the eyeball. Trust me, sugar. Whoa! Uh, Moxie, the eye's freaking out. If this slag stuff is powering the laser, we need to force as much of it as we can back into the eye. The increased power will trip a failsafe and let us shut everything down. The eyeball may not like it, but it'll be fine, honey. Come on, damn it. Warning. Space-time instability detected. Entering protective mode. See? Just like I said. 
With that fail-safe trip, we can reboot, and then the laser will be all yours. Hooray! Wait! Don't press that button! What's wrong? If the eye starts acting weird again during the reboot, I don't want to be anywhere near it. Thanks to the fail-safes, it couldn't possibly do anything other than shut down. Yeah, well, agree to disagree. All right, let's get back to the command center. With Zarpa nuts dead, we can reboot the laser remotely from there. Yay! <coughs> well, this isn't as an, uh, an action-packed an episode I was hoping for. Basically, we beat Colonel Zarpadon, I guess. Alrighty, the bad guy's dead. We're about to save the moon, and the vault full of cool ass alien stuff is apparently already open. Just shut down the laser, and we can get to the fun part finding that vault. I'll let you do the honors. Reboot sequence activated. Command control reset. Rebooting Yay. in. Shut down aborted. Hooray! Valid oh. energy configuration. Great. Oh, great. What now? Jack. I'm sorry. I'm not. Warning. Singularity detected. Whoa! What the hell? Good job, everybody. What's Moxie? What the hell are you doing? Betraying you. Trying to kill you. Two things I should have done a long time ago, you power-hungry psychopath. What do you mean, Moxie? How did you even... I've been watching you, Jack. And behind that smile, behind that hero complex, there's something wrong about you. If you come down from Helios alive, a lot of decent people will live to regret it. For now, we just need to get to that vault before they do. Dumb bastards probably want to destroy what's in there. Zarpadon said a tangle of chemical filth. She means Dahl's old backup work refinery site. Get back to the moon's surface and check it out. There's got to be something there that'll lead us to the vault. <sighs> so, this is the other point in the game where Jack just goes insane. Betrayed by his friends. I mean, we're, having a, we're having a good time. We're having a good time. Now where am I going? Need to locate the main site here. Warning, no where am I going? Where are Stoust going? Co-op partners? No, co-ops would have messed up this recording. Here's how it is. You search that site for a way into the vault. We go there, we get what's inside it, and we use it to kill Lilith, Roland, and all those sons of bitches. I find this horrifying, but we'll go along with it anyway. Hyperion Hunter spotted. 
area, but just enough. A lock bar! Wow, that actually hit him. Ah, there's where the underleveling is. Eternals, though. Those things pack the wall. Fortunately, I pack more of a wall of oh god. some Star Wars mission around here that I'm actually gonna put on the recording. I might be able to kill this guy. What about behind me? Perfect. Come on, baby, die. Nice! Legion. That's kind of funny. Not gonna lie. I'm a little amused. Maybe under level, but I'm definitely holding my own here. So, since Sarpatrick is dead, I'm gonna go ahead and throw some loaders your way. Moonshot's pinpointing you right now. Try oh. not to be standing under the supply fire. You don't want to do that. Why are these assholes still fighting? Your leader's in history. Why not kick back, take a break, and listen to sights? I do not stand a chance. Oh, 
anymore, I've noticed. recording right off the bat and I'm now violently under leveled for the area that I'm currently in yeah that's one way of putting it oh hey good respawn nice I'm a big boy. And handle my own. Alright guys, I'm going to cut her right here for the day. As you can see, I am drastically underleveled for what I'm trying to do. And the recording messed up, so this actually puts me way ahead of where I actually want to be. So guys, until next time, be seeing ya.